Hello, my cutters. My name is Vatcraft, and today I have this super fast and compact snowball farm. Um, in today's episode, I will um, explain how this farm works, and also I will show you how to build this machine by yourself. Yeah, let's begin today's episode. All right, let's uh, explain a bit about the farm. First, uh, we were gonna go into the numbers, and so this farm can produce two snowballs every two redstone ticks, or zero point two seconds. And uh, yeah, if we do the math, that equals to um, thirty six thousand items per hour, which is insane for such small farm. Next, let's go into the uh, redstone. There are four pistons on both sides of the farm, uh, as you can see here. And these pistons uh, are destroying the snow layers and turn the snow layers into snowballs. Uh, these two sets of pistons are activated at a different time, so we can get uh, this like alternating piston movement in order to get the most snowballs possible. And also these pistons are extending and retracting at the fastest speed possible in SD. And to achieve this speed, I use uh, this very simple clock like here, as you can see. And uh, all the snowballs are being collected by the hoppers and put into the double chest, as you can see. So yeah, that's basically the farm. Uh, or the restaurant has been explained. It is a very small farm and yeah, not too much is like happening here. It's just a very simple and overpowered snow farm. All right. Um, for this tutorial, I will gonna build an update version of this farm. So yeah, first you need to prepare a four by five by four area. I have already prepared one right here. Next, you should prepare all of these materials. So we have seven white concrete or circuit block. We have eight uh, glass block uh, for you to see and also to prevent the snowballs from flying out. Uh, for fence gate of any uh, uh, like wood type. Uh, for chest. Um, for hoppers. For piston. One sticky piston. A redstone block. Seven redstone dust one lever, two snow blocks, and a carved pumpkin or a jack-o'-lantern if you want. Alright, let's build this. First, get your chest out and choose uh, the front of your yeah, dump shop farm. So I will choose this be my yeah, the front of my farm. So place two chests like so, then place two more chests like that. Next, we need to get the hoppers and put them like so as you can see uh, next we need to get the piston so get four piston now and place them like so we need to place in the glass as well so get uh, like your glass out and place it like so then you need your right concrete place them like that then a block here and two blocks like so oh and now you need to place your redstone dust on all of those blocks you need to place your sticky piston oh uh, let me get the lever as well so place a sticky piston here and a redstone block here and now the block is activating stop it using a lever like that now we need to put the snow golem in there and to do that is very simple first you place in wait no you place in four fence gate like that then you place your snow golem and quickly push it to the middle of the farm like that now if you just activate the farm a bit as you can see, the snow golem is now in position, 
and we can see some snow all flowing in and now we can take a the car and yeah, as you can see we are producing snowballs so yeah that's basically it about this tutorial well uh, this is the end of today's episode I uh, really appreciate everyone for watching today's episode and because I want to show my appreciation I w we're gonna show this um, yeah, pretty ridiculous farm right here this thing is a an overpowered snow farm capable of producing over 200,000 snowballs per hour and the reason why I don't show you how to build this farm is because this thing can crash your game in under one minute if you don't have a good hardware or you yeah, yeah or your storage system cannot keep up with the yeah the constant flow of snowballs now i will gonna end today's episode here and well to uh end this in a spectacular way I'm gonna activate this farm. So yeah, hope you guys enjoyed today's episode. It was a lot of fun to make. And yeah, I will see you guys in the next episode of Fun Restore. So yeah, goodbye and have a great day everyone.